back in my element. Are you ready? I don't know what I'm ready for, but I'm ready. <laughs> I'm Ella Dove, and this is What the Wellness, the show where I try out the latest and greatest wellness trends, treatments, and experiences. Today, I am back out in the real world at Masakanai Salon on the Upper West Side, where I'm going to have a one-hour head spa treatment. This is a $220 hour-long treatment that's meant to completely detox my scalp. Now, I've done a little bit with my scalp, but today's treatment is different because it takes a much more holistic approach to scalp care. Wow, this is nice. Oh yeah, time to take it down. It's very dirty right now. <laughs> what you brought you here today? I feel like I have a lot of buildup mm -hmm. and no matter how much I scrub at home, mm -hmm. like I always, if I go like this with my fingernail, mm -hmm. you see I always have. Yeah. When was the last time did you wash your hair? Yesterday. Yesterday? <laughs> How often do you wash your hair? I try to do it every other day, but I okay. end up probably every day. Every day. And actually, it's clean. <gasps> and I don't find like a buildup. Wow. But did you notice that there's a little reddish? Yes. Did you sleep well last night? Uh, not great. Not great? No. Right? How about, do you feel tired right now? Exhaustion level? Pretty tired. tired. <laughs> <laughs> a little reddish and then pinkish. And healthy scalp is a, looks like a very white, bright white, yep. clear. But this can tell you need a little bit more rest. Mm-hmm. Okay. It all comes back to stress. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to start with uh, uh, breathing. Breathing uh, ritual together. Ooh. Let's take a nice deep inhale through the nose. The next inhale. Back where I belong. Ooh. See, can you tell me a little bit about how you developed this treatment? So, this head spa is originally uh, developed in Japan about 20 years ago, inspired by ancient Asian head massage. Since I came to United States, New York, I noticed that uh, many Americans has a scalp concern compared to Japanese. So, we started more like a wellness treatment. I'm asking a, a customer, uh, what do you eat? And then what kind of uh, self-care routine? Did you sleep well? So I'm using this multi-sensory experience to heal the customer mind. This helps the Open up the pour. Our hands also have a lot of acupressure point. And we're gonna place a little bit of your face and your eyes. You release the chemicals, the good hormones. It's run all over your body, entire body. I could feel that. <laughs> so now we're gonna dry your hair. Perfect. Thank you. How do you feel? Very, very chill. <laughs> very chill. <laughs> All clean. The moment. Truth. It does look cleaner. See, 
it's more wider. Yeah. So earlier, you had a little inflammation, a little bit reddish scalp. Yeah. Maybe I need to start committing to eight hours a night <laughs> instead of six yeah. slash five and a half. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Oh, I feel so much lighter. Like most things in this wide world of wellness, stress plays a huge part in our overall well-being, and our scalp health is no exception. In today's treatment, we really focused on mindfulness. That hour of tuning in and zoning out the rest of the world actually helped decrease that inflammation, soothe my scalp a little bit, and now I'm so fresh, so soft, so clean. So hopefully I can hold on to some of that mindfulness and really take my hair care practice to a more holistic place. At the very least, I'll be less stressed and that's a good thing too.